Hello everyone, this is Jade and welcome back to Founder's Fortune. I think I may have figured out something here that we may need to do for this. Um, they do not like this because they say that uh, they're missing floor tiles in their house. So I'm thinking what we may need to do here is I may leave this. I think we might actually, actually I might change this. I think we're going to have to take this door out. And we're going to take this door out. Okay, yes, somebody's burnt out. That's typical. We'll take those out. And then I think we need to take these doors out. Because I don't want this to be considered inside. And I think right now they consider it inside. So if we have all this blocked off, we're going to leave this because we can probably put like decorations or... You know, something in here, possibly, that they can still get around. But this here, if we remove these, um, why is there, why do I have that there? Let's get rid of that. Um, can you do what I, could, where are you going? Where are you going? You're going for food. Yeah. What are you doing? Renee, first of all. You need to get your tukus over here and start sowing tomatoes, not researching. Where's your research? What are you even? You're at level one of scholar. See, things seem to not be working as intended. Um, as far as I am aware of, the three stars means that's their priority job. I may have to test that because she keeps going back to research, yet she's supposed to be tending the fields. Okay, why can I not? There, okay, that's right. I'm going to get that. So she's got all this stuff to do, yet she keeps going to the research. Um, I really don't want her mining crystals either, I don't think. All right. Well, we'll have to see. I may have to look into that. That was my understanding. And it's hard because there, there doesn't seem to be any standardization to any of it. Uh, like with RimWorld, one is a priority. But with this one, I think three is a priority. So it can get kind of a little clunky at times. So we're going to need to take a wall out here. Here. I don't know if I have to have this set up the same, but let's see. What if we take that out? And then she takes this out. We can take this whole wall out. Get rid of that. We can, oh, hey, never mind. <laughs> Just take the whole door myself. Oh, maybe I don't want to take the whole door. What if we do it that way? That's probably stupid. Uh, yeah, maybe. Is that stupid? We can just leave it that way. Then we might replace this with stone. And I think I... I pro yeah, I do. I have to take this out first. Luckily, it just goes away. And then we'll put some stone down here and see if this gives us our our outside area that we want all right we'll do that Oh, but see, if we do that, then we can do this. Okay. Yeah, that'll work. And then we can put little stuff in. And, and you can see now how it's off a little bit. But you know what? I'm going to live with that. Because I'm not changing it. And now look what we've got. Nice. Okay. So now they can come up here. Now... 
I'm thinking the only other way to get this would be to put up walls and doors. I'd have to have walls around this, though, too. No, maybe would I? Yeah, I'd have to have, like, walls around these a little bit and have doors in them. And I would have to do the same thing. Well, this is here. Um, I have to do the same thing down here to have these stairs, like, blocked in, and then it would probably have a roof over that. But I'm going to worry about that at another time. I just want to kind of get this other stuff done right now. And we're, like I said, we're going to leave this so they can just kind of walk through. Because we've got these separate rooms. So there's probably no point in really opening things up. Because then if we do that, we're like completely opening everything. I kind of wanted um, walls here. And I may actually put a fortification up. Like I could probably do that. Because we don't want a wall there. Um, so we either need fortification or fencing. So I guess we could do that. But do I want to do that? See, that's the thing. I don't know that I want to do that. Though I kind of still want it because I feel like all I did was cut these two like in half. <laughs> Let's just put up a fence. We don't have a fence gate. But we can at least do that. Because I don't think we can fit, or can we? I think this... Ha oh, you know what? Um, Small Palisades gate? How would that work? Okay, I get it. It's got to be built in a wall, but it looks like it's got to be, um, it probably have to be wider than that. All right. So we'll have to keep that in mind next time. I was kind of hoping that we could just put a little, little gate in here. That would have been kind of cool. But one, two, three, it looks like it takes up four. So yeah, that is not going to work. All right, well, I guess for now, we're just going to leave it. We'll leave the fencing there. I wish they had gates, like, I mean, like fence gates. I don't think we have those. We have a great fortress gate, a castle gate. Yeah, so they need fence gates as well. It'd be nice. So, yeah, I'm, I'm half tempted to just block that off somehow with the fortification and not worry about it. Yeah, because they don't need to be. I mean, it kind of sucks that they have to go around, but I guess, yeah, I guess we'll see how that goes because I don't think I'm going to like this. All right, well, let's pause the bug infestation for just a minute. I'm not even sure how that's going to look. Will this, like, blend in better, maybe? I don't know. We can change it if we don't like it. But it kind of blocks it. And then when we get stone, we'll, we'll do stone at some point. All right, somebody... Needs to come over here. Let's put him on high. Mm -hmm. Renate. Come over here. Is she back? Was she studying again? See, it shows farming as her priority. Like, that's the job she has. It seems like that is the main priority. So, I don't know why she is ignoring that. I, it, it, that is going to drive me nuts. But hopefully it's something that they get straightened out at some point. Because now you guys have lost all of your tomatoes. All of them. Yep. Yeah. You need to sow tomatoes. That's what you need to do. Okay, and you are working on that. Okay, that is good. Um, we still need to put one of these. Do we have enough wood finally for one of these? 
Not that they're using them. Where's that under military training dummy? And I think we can actually put this inside too. So it's something that they could probably do in the winter and they could stay inside and I don't know. Where else are we going to put? I guess we could put it like out here. Mm. How about we put up three of them? Not enough cotton. All right, well, two of them it is. <laughs> yeah, you... All right. Yeah, I'm not worried about a trader right now. Um, can you go gather cotton? And how much... Oh, we... Okay, let's, let's build some more iron ore storage here. We want to get that iron ore. And we want to keep it coming in. Now, I think once they build it, it's not a problem. I know they can't go through it once it's built, but it's not like they have to go over there to store it or to get it. So we're going to do it that way. Well, I guess, actually, he can still get to that, so. We'll do it that way. And let's see about getting more cotton storage. Because we need that. Uh, I don't know. Well, we probably, maybe we should get some more stone as well. Okay. Now, what about more wood storage? I don't know where we, we could probably put that somewhere else. But I guess it's probably fine right here. Let's just build another one. Get two more of those, maybe? Okay, you're blocking. Alright, well... I'll just put it there. It gives us three more. I'm not too concerned about this just yet. What about food? Raw food? Yeah, we can store 260. It's the cooked food that's probably more what we need to worry about storing. And if this is eventually... If this is eventually going to be the kitchen, I suppose, we'll see if we can put up another one of these here. And eventually we're... Pro what? Why did you lose... Go the heck are you doing out here? Oh, you broke a leg and I didn't even notice. Son of a... Alright, um... Give him food. Oh my god. Alright, no. Don't walk yep. off. Now what do you need to do? You need to carry him to bed. I guess I'm going to have to put a gate in. It's the only reason she got out there that quick is because we had a, we haven't finished, they haven't finished building it yet. I, what was he even doing out there? You dummy. All right. Um, Bridget. Is he in bed? He is. Um, get out here and construct this. Just get it done. Maybe that way nobody will go wandering outside. This is kind of a way I can corral them in. Until I want them to go out. Alright, now. Can you build this one? I don't know if they're going to be able to reach that one. Where are you going? Okay. There is no cutting trees. I want you to go get that taken care of. So, I don't know, do we have the sh nice sheep trapped in here at this point? Oh, and he's back up and moving again. Um, how are you doing? Mm -hmm. Oh, you want a sleeping spot. That's right, we do need to get you a sleeping spot, don't we? Uh, everybody else has one. Okay, can we... Okay, we need 25 wood. I am so sorry, buddy. Um, for now... You can take ownership on that one. 
And at least you have something to do. And I can move this further back up against that wall. Okay. Um, you're in serious pain. Why don't you go sleep until you're healed? That would probably be helpful. Sorry you're in pain. I don't think we actually have any medicine. Mm -hmm. Talk about food and press and salt. No, we don't have any healing potions. All right. And what is your problem? What? Okay, you can't get at something. Is that the problem? All right. Uh, really? All right, well... Let's see here. Why can't you get at that? Mm -hmm. Go here. Well, let's just see. Well, I have a feeling that we didn't get very many tomatoes at all because somebody... Okay, now can you reach this? You can't. All right, well, let's get rid of that. Oh, we have stone. Can you build it if it's... A... Whoops. Can you build it there? I just want to make sure that we yep. have the stuff blocked. All right. So the hope is that'll keep them out. Okay, enough. Go on. Go back and do whatever it is you're doing. I think everything else is closed up. Okay. So you ought to be done. You go back and, and do whatever it is you're doing here. Go. Oh, stockpile's full. Really? It's full of cotton? Okay. Joseph is mad. Can we get more cotton storage? No. They need 25 wood. Okay, Bridget, go chop a tree. You are chopping a tree. Okay. What? Mm -hmm. Renee, what are you doing? Sewing potatoes. Okay. Well, at least Yosef is over there sewing potatoes. Why? Uh, well, I guess we're okay so far. I don't... Okay, whatever. Okay, so how are we doing here? We've got those built. So if we go up... All right. So now we need fencing. We probably need to replace that. Uh, let's see. Floors. We'll replace this out here since this is supposed to be outside. There's that everything. I hope so. Get rid of this here. And replace that. Now, will we figure out some way to do something? I don't know. I don't know if we're going to be able to. It's probably going to be something to play around with and see. I'd really like to have the stairs inside and just have doors right here. So I might be able to do that and leave everything else open. So, you know, it's almost like an elevator shaft. But the problem is, well, no, I guess if we have to come in one spot, though. I don't know how that's going to work but we'll find out. So the next thing we need to do is figure out where we're going to put these things. So we've only got 63 wood. So Bridget needs to be out. She shouldn't be actually doing any of this. What are you doing? Oh, you're still mad? You had a nightmare and you're unprepared for winter. Yep. Well, you know what? You could go help plant. Go cut trees. That's what I need you to do. Go cut trees. See, Joseph is, he's, he's doing good. He, he can help with all this kind of stuff. All right. So we got 17 tomatoes. Nobody's getting apples. We have apples over here. But we're probably going to have to figure out somewhere to maybe plant another orchard of them. And eventually, hopefully, we're going to be able to do something with sheep. And I'm hoping that they put other animals in for... Um, like farming kind of stuff too. 
Fishing would be nice. I think we'd be kind of cool to be able to build a fishing pier out here and fish. And it would be nice if you had like little islands and you could actually build a bridge and build some places on islands. That would be kind of cool too. There's a lot of things that would be nice to see with this. Okay. Um, so we need to, we do need to start getting these guys. Let's see, he heads right off. No, he's not now. Okay, where are you going? Can I actually get you to, you're going to eat. All right. You got to sit down to eat a raw tomato. All right. I guess that's fine. Well, how many, how many do you need? Now, can I get him to chop trees? Why don't you go cut a tree? That would be helpful. Yep. How's everybody else doing here? Yeah. You have two reward points. Mm -hmm. You have one. What do you want? Store at least a hundred meals in preparation for winter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll see about that. <laughs> Got a flower pot in your room. Okay, so they're all worried about being unprepared for winter. Yeah, you're only in the summer. You've got fall to go through yet. I think you'll be fine. Just do your job. See, that would be amazing if you would do your job. Are you warming your fanny by the fire? <laughs> oh my god, you guys. I'm glad that you're building. Joseph, can you go chop a tree? No, go cut a tree. Where are you even going? Were you going to get Abity? He was going to get apples. Why did Okay, both of you can go chop trees. That, or you can go do... Okay, that works. That is just fine. Because it's the only way you guys are actually going to get your own rooms. Uh, let's see. Yes, and obviously I realize this is uh, taking uh, quite a bit of time, but this particular project, I guess, is kind of a big project. I decided to go with this rather than like build individual places this time. Okay, so there we go. So that will hopefully keep anybody from falling, though I don't think they can fall off the side, but you know, who knows. It just looks safer that way. And we'll get maybe a nicer fence or something up there at a later date. But for now, this will do it. And this at least protects the rest of the colony. We'll get uh, probably stone. We can actually do stone right now. Let's actually... Oops. Am I not... Oh... I hope I didn't do a bad thing here. Is this supposed to be? I don't know. I'll have to check that. I guess let's go ahead and replace this with stone now that we have it. I don't, we're not having any issues with goblins or anything. They're not bothering us. So, but eventually, you know, if we go bother them, they may have a problem with us. That doesn't match, but at least it's fortification enough to keep them out. So that works. All right, now I want to check. I'm really thinking is sometimes I might have to take that up, but I don't think I'm going to do. I'm just going to leave that. That is fine. Um... Oh, okay. What? did I do? I'm, uh, yeah, I don't think I was supposed to do that. Um, I think we still want wooden floors up here. Right? Because this is where the walls come in around. Okay. And then... Yeah. All right. Well, I don't know who's doing whatever, but is this where 
We need to bring a wall this way. What's going to suck is when it's time to replace this. At least it's not too bad. So we want to do that. Um, I guess leave that open so that they don't get themselves stuck because they need to be able to get back in here. Well, this is where we need it to be, right? Okay. Because they need to get back in here to be able to do these floors that we haven't even started laying down yet. Okay. So I guess we're just going to have to start. We're going to go through our wood really, really quickly. But that's a start. But it's not that we don't have the storage. It's just that they're not doing that quick enough. Um, have we done anything? Okay, we've got masonry done. So do we have a masonry tip? So we need wood. All right. So she's still working on this stuff. Um, I need you guys to harvest tomatoes. Uh, yo, yo, come that yep. could have been helpful with that. Um, you harvest tomatoes. We need to get these done. You know, we can probably just make this a little bit bigger and turn it into a freaking barn. Sheep seem to enjoy it. So, is somebody out chopping wood? Okay, this last day is summer, so potatoes are good until fall. So we need to make sure we get these tomatoes today. Renee? Yeah? No, I need you to work on the tomatoes. Tomatoes first, because this is the last day. Thank you. Okay. So when she gets those out of the way, now you can go work on your stuff there. How are we doing on wood? Yosef is building away. And eventually we're going to have to put, actually, wood all up around these two. So that is kind of cool leaving it that way, but maybe we'll put something up at the very top. Oh, that could be kind of neat if we could do that, but I don't know if we can. I don't think we can. It'd be nice if we could take, like, grass or dirt and put that down and then put stuff on it. That would be kind of cool, because then we could have, like, a rooftop garden. But, yeah, I don't think we can do that, which is too bad. Okay, now, what did I want to do? <laughs> I don't even remember what I wanted to do. Okay. Um. Yeah, I have no idea. You're just, you're just, oh, it was something I needed wood for. I can't remember. Um, I thought I was going to build something. Oh, yeah, I remember. We still need more wood. All right, so who is... It's now fall. All right, well, good. We had all that. We're still worried, working with the tomatoes, oh, and she, or the potatoes, and she's cooking. So I think we'll be okay. I mean, we've got 61 cooked food. She, we still have fall to go through. So I think we're good there. Uh, let's see, we could do deep ore mining. We need 600 coins, so we're going to have to actually start trading in order to do that. I'm still trying to keep the uh, pirates off our backs, so we're not even trading. I do want to get this mason's workshop, so somebody needs to actually get out, and you need to chop a little bit faster. Um, who else can we get out there? Joseph. I don't know what you're doing, but you seem to be in a better mood, at least. Why don't you go cut trees? Um, Yoakum, I'm not exactly sure what you're doing. And it's funny because it seems like Renate's doing more research than Yoakum, and that's, like, his main job is researching. Go cut some trees. And then we'll get um, Bridget. Bridget. Get Bridget out there, and she can do some trees as well there we go 20 so let's um let's get this mason's workshop put up and we'll just put that in the corner i guess right 
put that there and then just kind of move that over just a little bit so they're spread out a little bit uh okay somebody come and build this like quickly can you go construct that oh you were close anyway okay and we need to get you a bed built too okay so wait what mm -hmm. got a fireplace well you're dumb i don't know if you should have a fireplace okay so we can make stone swords but nobody can use them <laughs> so um uh, we're going to work on stone axe and stone pick. So we need 60 stone. So, yeah, somebody's going to have to be mining stone. Oh, 60 and 80 stone. And then we need wood. All right. So that's job for that. I can't queue that up, though, can I? Which kind of sucks. Oh, I can. All right. So we'll just do one of each, I guess, at this point. Desperation. What? Oh, you dummy. Okay. Hang on, buddy. I'll get you out. Go on. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I guess I did kind of get you trapped in a corner there, didn't I? All right. Well, we need a wall. We don't have any wood. All right. <laughs> so <laughs> we'll just leave that, I guess. Bridget, her leg. Oh, my God. Everything's just going wrong. Okay, so you didn't do that bad. You just... All right. Um, Renee, can you perhaps splint her leg as she's, like, hobbling further and further away? It's like, where are you going? Can you stop? Oh. Okay. Seriously? Okay, well, at least it's splinted six yep. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um... You need to come back here. Yosef's a better farmer than you. What do I have him set to? Yeah. That is funny. Um, no, he set it too for a priority. But he'll never learn anything. But that, that's fine. I mean, he can help do the stuff. All right, well... How are everybody doing? Okay, you guys are still... You have time. That's right. They actually increased the amount of time that you had for stuff. For them to get old and stuff. Um, I'm not worried about that just yet. Decoration. Or brewery. Because then we could grow pumpkins... And we could grow wheat. And we could build a brewery. And we have 90 iron. We just have to keep him mining. Though I know we need decorations. Because there's some things that they want. That we don't have. Uh, you know what? Let's just go with decoration. Then we'll... Hmm... I guess we'll move into the brewery at that point in furniture. Anything that slows those pirates down. What are you doing, buddy? All right. So let's take this and we'll move it over here. And let's build another bed. Do we have enough to build a bed? We do. Okay. Sometimes I feel like I should space their beds out just a little bit. Not enough wood. Why do I not have enough wood? Who built something? <laughs> really, guys? Okay. Well, Virgit, I don't know what you're doing, but cut a tree. You probably were somewhere. You probably wandered as far away as you possibly could. Oh, we are max 80 cooked food, so well, we should be fine. As long as you can store the raw ones, we'll be okay. We'll be fine. The Bridget's getting old. She's got like 50 days left. But we're not anywhere near ready to have, like, kids in this colony just yet. Okay. Um, now, can I, can I build him a, a bed now so he's actually maybe happier? Or he could be happier. Um, 
well, okay, that leaves a little bit of space in between them. At least they're not, like, crammed together. Okay, so, Yosef, why don't you take ownership of that? So that should at least make you a little bit happier. Uh, you are not getting a fireplace right now. A scroll stand we could probably do, but it seems kind of a waste at this point because we can't get the scrolls just yet. And eventually we're going to need to build a graveyard. So the question is, is where are we going to put that? Now, whether we leave the farming here, we may move it somewhere. I don't know. Um, I may move it off to the side, possibly, where I could... What is that doing? That's... Okay. So, like, maybe we would put... Even though this is, like, really skewed because I think this is not uh, quite even here. But the idea might be to, say... Take like this area in here and maybe turn it into like farming. That could be interesting. Or we could actually bump this out a little bit, like take the wall and kind of just bring it one and then back over this way so that we could have fortifications here and actually put the, the gate in. And then maybe we can have this little area out here and they can have their little training dummies out there. That might be beneficial too. Could be interesting. Or we'll do it like, well, we can't really do it on this side, I guess, because we have this big thing here that I don't think I can move that. I can't even click on that, so. I guess out here, I don't know. I'd like to make like a little patio kind of thing or something. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Can we actually do this stuff yet? No, we need stone. So Yosef, we're probably going to have to send Yosef out to uh, mine some stone. Do we have, where do we have stone? I know we have some somewhere. I guess we're going to have to send him way out here. But he should be safe because we walled this off so that uh, these guys don't see him and they don't attack. You know, until they do. So we're max on cotton. We're max on crystals. We're coming up on winter from year four. Uh, I'm pretty comfortable with the amount of food that we have. Because we have a lot of cooked. And then we also have a lot of raw that can be cooked when need be. As they're getting low. So I'm, I'm pretty happy with that right now. So now it's just a matter of trying to get enough wood together so that we can actually start building their bedrooms, which we're going to do up here. Now they're going to consider this whole building their house, I assume. Um, but again, they may not because these are stairs up and this is like outside here. So they may not. They may consider this all, you know, once they get going. It just may be their house and I don't I don't know what they're gonna consider anything else so the big thing again is really it's gonna be figuring out how to make sure that they have enough room and how we're gonna do the rooms how many can we fit in here so we may like would this be one and then this come around would be two three. I don't know if we can fit like four and five. So it's going to be something to play around with. So we may actually end up wasting some wood as we figure out where these walls are going to go. Uh, all right. So we're really down. Well, we're down everything. And it would probably be helpful if we were able to build another another thing here. Another um, campfire food thing. Oh my, look at this. We're actually clearing this out too. Eventually we're going to have to start trading because we're going to need the coins to actually be able to build the deep mining. Now I think we have more out here somewhere. We've got some up here, which is good. 
And I thought we had some over here somewhere. We do. So there's some over here. So we're, we're still okay. That's good. And the farming. I don't know. We may set that up over here. I'm not sure yet. But we need an area we'll, we'll like fence it in and do some farming. Maybe we'll actually build some more buildings. I don't know. <laughs> it's like a, one big building here. I just wanted to see how that would work out. Maybe next time, like when we do another season with another update and stuff, maybe we'll spread out a little bit more this time and or next time and, and have multiple like buildings and houses and stuff like that. But we'll see. Uh, okay, so they still need more stone. All right, well, I don't need a trader. I have nothing that I really want to sell at this point. So I'm not going to worry about it. You probably have nothing that I want. Nothing that I'm willing to actually sell at this point in time. We have one coin. So. We need to get to a point where we're actually maxing a lot of this stuff out. What are you doing? You have potatoes that you can harvest. These things are going to die. This is like the last day. Get over here and harvest these potatoes. Because it's like, it's, it's, you're going to lose some. I, I would be surprised if they don't. Because, yeah, in the morning, no. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. yeah. Get over here and harvest these potatoes. Yeah, see? You could have gotten a few more potatoes, you moron. <laughs> I <laughs> oh my god. They just do whatever they want to do. Just whatever. Alright, we need to get a wooden well, I guess. I had something I hadn't even thought about. Do we have any... Yeah, we do. So for now, we'll put it here. Bridget, go build that. And then you guys can concentrate, hopefully, on getting some more wood and stuff like that. What are you doing? Put whacking trees. Okay. So we had some decorations. So that's good. Um, let me see what we got here. Just out of curiosity. So we can do potted plants. Uh, Little trees in pots, stone pots. We've got uh, vases, vases, curtains, window panes, some nice windows with some shutters. We can get some hedge corners and some small hedges. And now we can do a simple fireplace. And we can do statues. But we're not going to worry about statues. Um, eventually, we'll be able to put some of these up too. We'll probably put these up around the front and stuff like that. Or, oh, you know what? We should probably put some around the inside here. We're not going to worry about it right now because I think it is time to go ahead and end this episode. So we need to continue working on our giant building here. And we'll take one quick look. I'm not even going to look at you. Just to see um, if we've unlocked anything else. Um, as a forester, she can use stone tools. So we will have her do that. And you're still on you. Mining. Okay, you don't have any crafting and stuff like that that you can do just yet. Renette, or Renate. Okay, we're not going to worry about the wheat just yet until we see where we are. Craftsman. Okay, and you're not up to anything yet. Oh, you can teach, though. Um, darn it. I'm really thinking we might want to... You know what? I'm going to wait because we want the research scrolls. So I think I'm going to wait on that. And is anybody else... Is a miner. Oh, you can do deep crystal mining or metal tools. 
Metal tools would probably not be a bad thing, but we can't do that just yet either. Because I think we need forging first. So I think we'll just hang on to the points for now and figure out where to go from there. And somebody's going to have to start studying crafting because we're going to need the forging and all that kind of stuff. And the tailoring, apparently. So, and... Yeah, I'm surprised. Do you not... Okay, that's right. We decided to hold off on that so we can get the points for that. All right, so we're going to go ahead and call that here, guys. I certainly hope it is not snowing in here. I mean, the snow's not building up, so I... I pretty sure we are still inside so as i said we're going to end that here and the next time we will continue working on our monstrosity of a building and then we'll see about maybe adding some things to it eventually to have it maybe start to look better but right now the idea is just to get the floor down get the walls up figure out how we're going to do the rooms and where they're going to go and hopefully fulfill more wishes so thanks for watching guys and we will see you next time. Bye.